Hey guys, it's Kat. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here with the brand new S24 series and I'm so excited to show you all the new AI capabilities that are so cool. So without further ado, let's get right into it. The first feature I want to show you guys is circle to search. You long press the home button and then circle to find out exactly what you're looking for. You can search clothing to know exactly what item it is, landmarks to know where it's located, or even recipes like these delicious waffles. There are so many ways I can use this in my day-to-day -day life, and it's actually really cool because you can circle any image or video without ever leaving the app. There is no more gatekeeping with this circle to search feature. The next AI feature I think is an absolute game changer is the chat assist feature. I wrote, you were so late last night, so make sure you come today at 8 p.m. Do not be late and make sure you bring my sweater. Stop wearing my clothes. That definitely comes across with a little bit of attitude, but using the new chat assist feature, you can spice it up to be more professional. Now, if you click on writing styles, you can actually change the tone of your voice to be more professional, more casual, or even appropriate for socials. And it comes with recommended hashtags as well. It actually does a really good job. As you can see, it says, please ensure your punctuality today. You were very tardy last night. Let's try it out one more time. I'm going to say, I think I'm going to be late for the interview. Uh, I'm sorry. I hope this doesn't make me look bad. I still really want this job. All right, let's see what it says. All right, it says, I anticipate a slight delay in my arrival for the interview. I sincerely apologize any inconvenience this may have caused and assure you that it will not impact my commitment to this position. I remain enthusiastic about the opportunity to join your esteemed organization. That is so good. The chat assist is also amazing, especially if you're a student or young professional trying to spice up your emails and make them sound really professional. I think that is going to be extremely useful and you'll use it all the time. I'm currently here in a phone booth with the new S24 Ultra and I'm going to be trying out the live translate. So I'm going to be talking to someone. I'm going to be speaking to them in English. They're going to be responding in Spanish and the live translate is going to do all the work so we can have a seamless conversation. Let's try it out. I make the call. Then I click call assist. Live translate. Other person is in Spanish and I'm in English. Hi, I'd like to make a reservation for tonight for two people. Could I make it for tonight at 7 p.m.? Of course, yes. I have you. We have a lot of space and it's also parked for free. I just finished the live translate in Spanish. As you saw, it was super seamless. So now I'm going to try it in Korean. Let's go. Call assist, live translate, Korean to English. Hi there, how are you? Yes, hello. Hi, I'd like to order a taxi tonight from the Fountain Blue Hotel to the Las Vegas Sphere at 7 p.m. Yes, I'll prepare a black Audi vehicle. It can be calculated with equality and cards. Live Translate is also really cool and it's going to come in handy if you're traveling. It is currently available in 13 languages and I'm excited for it to be available in many more. Now let's try the Live Translate interpreter where I'm talking to someone side by side in real life. Also, this completely works offline. Let's check it out. Hola, como estas? Hello, how are you? I'm good, how are you doing? Estoy bien. ¿Qué onda? Todo bien, nada más aquí enseñando los teléfonos. ¿Cómo te gusta? Still nothing else here teaching phones. How do you like it? I'm having a wonderful day. This is such a cool experience. I'm so glad you guys had me here. 
The AI generated tools for photos are a game changer. This is going to change the way I edit my photos, simplifies it, and it's all in one spot. It's super easy to change the background, remove something from a photo with the click of a button. Let's play around with it. First, I'm going to click on the AI stars. Now I'm just going to circle around the subject I want to move and it very intelligently cuts it out for me. I think I'm going to move him up to the sky a little higher so he has his own moment to shine. I don't know if that looks realistic, but we're going to click on generate anyways. I think it looks pretty cool and it looks so realistic no one would ever know. Now I'm just going to remove this light post by clicking the same button and circling it. But this time we're going to click on the trash can to remove the image. I'm definitely going to use this all the time to remove random people from photos or trash cans in the background to make my photo look more clean and aesthetic. Now this feature you definitely have to try out. It is so fun and is going to trick so many people. I'm actually going to circle around the pavement and then click on generate and see what it comes up with. I was very shocked at how realistic this looks. Just wait till you guys see. This actually looks like a real skate park. I'm so impressed. Wow. I cannot wait to go through my camera roll and play with so many photos using this new feature. The next feature I can't wait to play around with is making instant slow-mo videos by long pressing on your screen like this. This cat video is such a cute example. Let me show you how it works. Basically, you just hold your finger down on the screen to make that section slow-mo. Then once you let go, it will continue going full speed. When you press edit, you can actually see the exact spot that you slow down and even fine tune it later. The next feature is a game changer when it comes to photo editing. The AI is actually smart enough to detect what adjustments should be made to a photo and it gives you recommendations to make the photo better. You can see here that it gives a suggestion to fix the shadows in this photo. And with a simple click of a button, the shadows are removed. It's actually quite impressive how well it worked. Now I'm going to try it on myself. When I took my selfie, the phone actually suggested that I use background blur because it realized it was a portrait. I'm excited to test this feature out in different lighting conditions, so make sure to hit subscribe to stay tuned because I'm going to be taking this phone everywhere and letting you guys know my thoughts. I wish I had this feature back when I was in school. This is transcript assist. Basically, you can record a voice memo and turn it into a transcript. It will actually differentiate between speakers and you can have the entire thing summarized. And you can also translate it into different languages. I could definitely see myself using this for taking down meeting notes, interviews, or even in lectures. I don't know about you, but my notes app is always jumbled and messy and I can't seem to find what I'm looking for. With the new AI note assist feature, you can actually auto format, summarize, correct spelling, or even translate a note to a different language. You can also have AI generate a cover for you so you can easily and quickly find your notes. I need to organize my notes ASAP, so I'm definitely going to be using this feature. Now let's try out the quad tally zoom system. So basically, it lets you do four stages of zoom at optical quality, and the camera zoom is actually enhanced with AI. As you can see right here, I used a hundred times zoom. The zoom is actually crazy, and you can see in the zoom map, it goes yellow when it's focused. Now pay attention closely and see how AI enhances this photo. I'm so excited to film so many more unboxings, review videos for you guys, so make sure to subscribe to stay tuned. Thanks so much for watching and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye!